Hey everybody, it's Professor Williams, and I'm here with Binomial Distributions, Broccoli, and Minitab Express. According to a national survey, 27% of Americans hate broccoli, and this qualifies us as a binomial distribution because we either hate broccoli or we don't. So we've taken a sample of 40 Americans, gives us an N or number of trials of 40, and what we're going to solve for is the probability that more than 10 out of the 40 hate broccoli. So what we're solving for is the probability that x is greater than 10. So I'm here in Minitab, and I'm going to my cumulative distribution function. And in this case, I'm going to need the cumulative distribution function because I'm solving for the probability of more than one value of x. Remember that the CDF in Minitab works so that the probability that's calculated is the probability that the value is less than or equal to a specified x value. In other words, it solves to the left. If you look at the graphic here with the CDF, you'll notice that it's the left-hand side of the curve that's in shadow, indicating that's the area that we are solving for. So I'm going to hit my CDF, get my input box, I'm going to have an input in form of a single value. In other words, I don't have a column of numbers. The value we were interested in was 10, and we're using the binomial distribution. Our number of trials was 40. Our event probability was 0.27, and then I hit OK. So what we see here is that Minitab has given, this, given us this cumulative probability but it's the probability that x is less than or equal to 10. So now what I know is that the probability that x is less than or equal to 10 is equal to 0 0.468 and change. So because of the way probability works, I know that the probability that x is greater than 10, plus the probability that's less than or equal to 10 has to equal 1. I'm going to determine this by simply subtracting this 0.468 from 1. So that gives me 0 0.532. And so now I know that the probability that more than 10 people in our survey would report that they hated broccoli is about 53.2%. Always remember that in this cumulative distribution function, this is your key. This is going to solve for the probability, always going to solve for the probability from your value of x all the way down to 0. It won't be long before you are a mini-tab ninja. In the meantime, I hope that you found this helpful, and thanks so much for watching.